The film starts showing a white mouse that is trapped in a labyrinth. It is trying to escape from that place. Then the scene shifts on a girl. She is seen in a chamber whose body is covered with many devices. She is astonished, waking up. She begins to remove the devices from her body. The system announces a message that the system has detected an error and there has left only 35% oxygen. The girl lying in the chamber feels as she is in the hospital, then she begins to be worried thinking where she has come, what was the matter with me? That girl starts shouting, it asks the system, who am I, how did I come here, can you tell my name? System calls her with mysterious name, and it is not her real name. Now that girl asks, can you show me how I look? Then system shows her image and she starts to visualize here. Again she visualizes some rats. She gets worried, because she is not understanding either she is bound in hospital or somewhere else. She begins to ask from system, system announces, I cannot reveal it as such, that girl says to it, let me take outside, then that system sounds, speak out your code, but she doesn't know any code. So she hits upon a plan, system is carrying it out what she is commanding, she commands the system to call the police, system calls police then she begins to talk with the officer. She says, I am bound somewhere, I don't know either it is a hospital or another place, I am bound in a chamber. She also tells the number of the chamber, but police officers are not getting any clue. That girl says to police, just detect my location while tracking my call, but suddenly the call is disconnected. That girl commands to system, tell me after checking my DNA, is it matching with someone else? Then system announces, yeah it is matching, it displays a girl which looks the same as that girl, her name is Elizabeth. It means that the name of this girl was Elizabeth, no one knows what changes that she faced and she bound here. Then police's call is received and they ask Elizabeth, then police asks about the amount of the oxygen level, that chamber system announces that the 31% amount of the oxygen level has left. That may be maintained only for an hour, but if Elizabeth continued to feel panic, it is not sure that she may spend here even an hour. Then police say to Elizabeth, just detect the owner of the chamber, there may be stated the name of the owner in the chamber. But it is not. Then system announces to Elizabeth, there has not remained enough oxygen and you have a very short time, may I kill you? Elizabeth forbids to do this. And she commands to it, search out more information about me, then she comes to know that she is a physician, and she had conducted an experiment. The chamber where she is bound today, it was the part of her experiment and she had bound herself, but she does not know any code or anything else. Then Elizabeth commands system that, open my social media account, where she gets her photo with her husband standing with her. She commands to system, try to contact with my husband's number, system carries out it. But a lady picks up the call as the phone is connected. Elizabeth says to her, make my contact with my spouse, that lady gets angry, she says to Elizabeth, never try to contact here again. Elizabeth is infuriated and she tries to unlock that chamber in spite of wasting time, but it is not unlocking. Then she encounters a rat, she gets scared from it, she encourages herself saying, it is not the time to be afraid, I know that it is my hallucination, because I am in the state of fear. She starts to unlock that chamber while catching a syringe, but nothing is happening then she receives a police call. Police officer says to Elizabeth, your mother used to live with you, Elizabeth tells, no I live with my husband, I have also called them but he is not picking it up. A lady is speaking at his place, then policeman says, you are thinking wrong, it is only your hallucination. When she casts a glance on her photos again, there is not Elizabeth's husband with her in the photos, it proved her hallucination in reality. Then policeman tells Elizabeth the name of her mother. Elizabeth says, no it is not the name of my mother. Then she hears that policeman is also conversing with other person. As someone is forcing him to deliver the wrong information to Elizabeth, then the call is disconnected and she receives the call of someone else. But Elizabeth commands to system, to ignore that call, she listens to the call recording of policeman, she want to listen with whom he is talking. Elizabeth believes after hearing the call that someone is really forcing policemen to mislead Elizabeth. She thinks, it may be possible that I am not getting strength to come out because of them. 
Then Elizabeth begins to hallucinate in which she encounters her husband, anyhow he is looking weaker, and Elizabeth is very upset. Then she receives a call again and again which belongs to that lady, who had forbidden Elizabeth to call. She says to Elizabeth, your husband is no more, Elizabeth says to her, no you are telling a lie, that lady declares, no I am speaking truth, and I also know that chamber where you are now, and I am also aware of the opening code, Elizabeth says to her, tell me that code, that lady reveals the code to her, Elizabeth immediately begins to use that code, that lady says to her, stop don't use it, your life will be at risk due to this, that lady says, because you are in the space, you have been sent in this unit in the space for a mission, but the system left out of order, when it moves upward, and you were set on the sleep mode, you yourself has no awareness, how much time did you spend in sleeping, you also take the low amount of the oxygen while sleeping, now you are using more oxygen as you have woken up, the amount of your oxygen is level is reducing for this cause, you will be lost after opening this unit because there is zero gravity, no one will be able to rescue you, I can set you on the sleep mode if you want it, you will never recall anything once you sleep. Elizabeth asks that lady, for which mission had I been sent, that lady tells, the world was going to destroy within a few years, and we chose you, because you were powerful. So you may find a suitable place, going to the space, where the human beings may live. But this system became out of order, and we had made you sleep. Elizabeth says, it is alright but what was the case of that policeman, why was he telling a lie with me, I know that he was talking with me as such after being influenced by someone. That lady says, you are thinking correct because everyone knows this, that there is no way to save your life. And they were consuming the time in conversation so your amount of oxygen level may reduce as soon as possible. And you may be dead, and we have no remedy except it, here Elizabeth is grieved. That lady says to her, don't be sad, if you really want to stay alive so move to the hibernation, otherwise, your oxygen level will be ended. Elizabeth says, okay tell me how to move in hibernation, that lady is going to reveal then some people sees her, coming to her house. She instructs Elizabeth, just move to the hibernation as the oxygen level goes on too, remember, you will be ended if the level goes below it. Here Elizabeth attempts to recall, how did it happen, can I return back, but she is unable to remember anything. She tries to unlock that chamber, then she starts to hallucinate as she is seated along with her husband, who is really ended after the spread of virus in the world, he was no more. Her husband is saying to her in fantasy, we will meet again, then Elizabeth says, before I die, it is better to talk with my mother. Then she commands the system to contact with my mother, Elizabeth talks with her mother. Afterwards, she commands to the system, is there only my chamber? Am I only one who is in the space? The system announces, No there are also 1000 chambers except your chamber. Then Elizabeth says, Why are they not appearing to me? It relates that there is a shield on the glass. Elizabeth is frightened as she uncovers it. There is a dead body outside which is floating in the air because of being in space. And there are also many chambers in her surroundings. She hallucinates that her husband is also in one of these chambers. She also glimpses her husband's chamber, commanding the system, and she gets excited as she casts a glance at the face of her husband. The hope for life is reawakened in her, then Elizabeth begins to hallucinate again, it was actually real visual on her past memory. Some experiments had been conducted on the rats, putting them into labyrinth, in case of succeeding this labyrinth by any rat. It was experimented to transfer that rat's genes and memory into the other rat. Either it is also able to cross the labyrinth or not. The subject rat used to cross this labyrinth at the first time, and these experiments were being conducted by Elizabeth, who had grown old in the actual world, and the lady who was contacting with Elizabeth, it was Elizabeth herself and Elizabeth who was in the space is just a clone of real Elizabeth. The experiment conducted which had been done with the rats, as the memory of one rat transferred into another rat. In the same way, the memory of the real Elizabeth was transferred into the clone of her, and all peoples present in the space are clone of their real one. Here Elizabeth notices that her oxygen level has reduced to 3%, Elizabeth commands the system, remembering the instruction of that lady, 
Set me to the hibernation. System clears that you have removed all devices on you, now it is not possible. Elizabeth begins to set the devices with her, but it is too late to set the devices with the body, because 2 percentage was required for going to the hibernation. Now her chamber had almost zero amount of the oxygen level. Then Elizabeth becomes very frightened, she knew that she will be dead, she records a voice message for her husband, so that he may hear it as he comes out from the hibernation. And she closes her eyes saying goodbye, then she hits upon a plan and she asks the system that the people who died in the space, their chambers are empty. Their chambers may had the oxygen till now. Then system announces, yeah absolutely, Elizabeth asks, is there oxygen may transfer to my chamber. The system declares, why not it is absolutely possible, all systems of the chambers are similar, so there is not any difficulty to transfer the oxygen. But many days are required for it, system says, so you will have to go into hibernation, then Elizabeth is extremely excited and says, okay I try, but kindly transfer the oxygen till that time. Then it is seen that the oxygen has transferred to that chamber, Elizabeth is also in hibernation. When Elizabeth wakes up after many years, then she is on a planet along with her husband, for which she had come into the space from the earth. She is very excited with her husband, and the movie also completes on this scene. I hope that you liked the video. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.